Promoting energy efficiency for sustainable conservation of Chamudongo Forest is a project of Arikoro and Anziza and the Swiss District, implemented in partnership with RDB Nyungwe National Park, Wildlife Conservation Society, and the Rural Environment and Development Organization, REDO. The project started in September 2014 to August 2015 and was funded by Critical Ecosystem Partnership Fund for a period of one year and was launched officially in Hungu sector. The aim of the project was to give a contribution on resolving one of the key major threats to Nyungwe landscape, which is deforestation based on the demand for fuel wood. According to the survey conducted around the Chamudongo in Hungu sector indicated that 70% of the firewood used in household is collected from Nyungwe National Park. By using modern cooking stoves, firewood used are reduced, which also led to the reduction of the number of trees that needed to be cut to meet the demand of users. This has a positive impact in the conservation and also in climate changes by diminishing the quantity of trees used daily. The deforestation is slow and considerably reduced and thus the soil is protected against erosion and the biodiversity living in the Nyungwe National Park, especially Chamdong Forest, is conserved. The main objective of the project is to promote energy efficiency around Chamdongo by distributing improved cooking stoves to increase awareness among others. Capacity building of local communities on stove making, dissemination and construction of cleanings, and promoting efficient wood stove adoption among the population around the Chamdongo forest. The communities have benefited a lot from these modern cooking stoves. The good thing is that we use little firewood. When the fire sets ablaze, nothing else is left. That's why we request for the second modern cooking stove, because one stove per household is not enough. The National Coordinator of Arikoro and Anziza, Mrs. Dansira Mukakamari, says that the project was successful on the ground. This project was very successful on the ground uh, in terms of achievement whereby members of cooperative have produced uh, 1,000 of approved cooking stoves that were distributed in households. Uh, and this project has also benefited this cooperative uh, because uh, the value of one stove was 1,500 and the total of the amount was shared between the members of cooperatives. Among the partners in this project included Rusiz district, whereby the district used it to face a lot of challenges from the local communities around Chamudongo forest. Rusizi district is bordering with the Chamudong forest. Like other districts in Jeno, which bordered with the forest, we faced the challenges of local communities entering the forest looking for firewood. This leads to the destruction of the natural forest by the people. The strategies include mobilization campaign to reduce the firewood used by increasing improved cooking stoves. That's why the three sectors bordering in Nyungwe forest, we have a plan of distributing 1,000 modern cooking stoves, but for the moment we have distributed about 600. The process continues, but also the communities should group themselves into cooperatives and they can do it as business. The chief park warden, Mr. Jirinyanjirui, believes that with the improved cooking stoves distributed to the people around the park, the trees cut in the park have reduced tremendously. It has been identified as people around the park are using a lot of wood, uh, but with the help of uh, energy saving stoves, we are seeing that we shall reduce uh, the use or the threat of cutting up trees, be it the buffer zone or the national park. Uh, Ariko Randanziza has been helping us uh, in a pilot project uh, around Chamudongo Forest, where we have uh, they have worked into sectors, but as you know, this is a small area, but uh, it has uh, shown us that uh, people are, are ready and uh, using it, and uh, it has reduced the wood consumption around the area. But as uh, national park as Nyungwe. Uh, we would like to extend these uh, energy saving stores all around the park. 
Mr. Gashumba from Redo said that in order to conserve Chamudongo better, we need to help people around the forest to have access to fuel stoves. Through our environment development organization, Redo, since its inception in 1999, have been involved in the community conservation activities around the protected area, including fuel stove dissemination. Uh, Ledo uh, partnered with the sport, uh, SPEF, SPEF funded the project via the Corona Ziza to bring in its expertise in uh, disseminating fuel stoves around the Kiamtongo natural forest. Following the survey we conducted with WCS funded project, we found uh, regarding the firewood used in the household, we, we realized that 70% uh, of firewood used in the community that surrounding those two forests, Nyungu and Kiamdongo, are coming from those forests. And one of the main conclusions was to help the people to have access to fuel stoves. The district mayor is grateful for the work done by Arikuru Andanziza and he wants this to be emulated in other sectors of the district. We are thankful for Arikuru Andanziza where they started in the three sectors, but we want to show them that the 200 stops distributed in each cell are too little. That's why we are appealing to them to extend this program to other sectors, train them on stove making. We are very thankful to the stakeholders, including the district, uh, the Park Authority, Redo, uh, and WCS for their strong partnership, uh, whereby they have contributed day to day uh, toward the achievement uh, of this project. The project operates in three sectors, which include Mhongo, Nyakabuye, and the Chitambi sectors in five cells. All in all, the project is on good path. It has helped the communities around Chamudong Forest, especially in the training on the forest conservation and the stove making. The distribution of 1,000 fuel stoves to local communities will help to reduce pressure on Chamudong Forest.